Hello and welcome to our challenge, our Kundalini challenge. Uh, today we are going to be doing a Kriya to relieve inner anger. And I haven't done this one before, so I'm going to need to read some of my notes as we go. But I really need this today. I don't know about you, but, um, you know, we cannot hold on to anger and stuff it down because it messes with our energy centers. And we cannot take it out on other people either because that obviously ruins relationships. So what do you do about being angry? Well, you do a Kriya. You do a series of exercises that will uh, release this anger. So let's tune in. And I'm not saying you're angry today. I've had a rough day and I'm gonna work it out in Kundalini. And this is why I love Kundalini so much because they have a meditation or a Kriya for everything that happens in our lives. Whether it's health, wealth, um, something that makes you mad, they have a Kriya or a meditation or something for it. And that's why I've really connected to this practice. So hopefully this will help you if you can um, use it today or any other day in your life. So let's tune in. Okay, let's rub our hands together. Take a deep breath. And exhale. Hands to the heart center. We're going to um, chant three times. Om Namo Guru Dev Namo. And inhale. Om Namo. yourself towards another person towards a situation or maybe even a stranger just bring that in find it in the body and we're just gonna work it out all right so the first thing we're gonna do is lay down so get comfortable we're just gonna lay here for 30 seconds with a relaxed posture and um, palms down okay let's just take 30 seconds Breathing, connecting to the ground, connecting to your body. You kind of feel, tip that chin down a little bit, feel the back of the head, get into the floor. You can feel the shoulder blades kind of relax down in your pocket. And then we're gonna um, bring our legs up six inches from the floor and we're gonna hold for two minutes except we're only gonna do one minute so we're just getting our little um, feet wet with this Kriya okay six inches and this balances your entire system okay so lift your legs up you can't see me <laughs> I'm still working on this six inches up okay and let's hold So not two feet or three feet, I'm literally six inches off the ground. And let's relax. Ooh. Okay, now we want to do breath of fire with holding our feet up, okay? Still six inches. And breath of fire is exhale out, belly comes in. So you're gonna see your belly go like this. Exhale out, belly comes in. Inhale, belly goes out, and your legs are up six inches. Toes are pointed, hands are down by this ground. And um, let's see what you're doing with your head. Okay, head back, 
and up, just a smidge. Ready? And breath of fire. You're looking past your toes. Oh, and let's take a break. Ooh. <laughs> okay, let's do it 10 more seconds. We can do it. Ready and up, breath of fire. Just relax on the ground. Okay, you did good. So we almost have a minute in, probably more than 45 seconds. Now we're going to lay back again with our hand, with our legs up 90 degrees. Okay, and we are going to bang out. This is for supposed to be for two minutes. We're going to do another minute, and we're going to bang our anger out. Here we go. you can get out and get it out. This might hurt with jewelry on, so take your jewelry off. so you don't hurt your neck. Okay, now we're gonna stick our tongue out and we're gonna inhale with our tongue out and exhale through our nose. Okay, inhale. Inhale, tongue out. Exhale, nose. your neck back. One picture shows her up and one picture shows her back. So let's inhale. That was hurting my neck after a little bit. And we're all building stability muscles. So you want to be a little sore or you want to, but remember, we don't want to cause pain. Okay, let's do an inhale again with our tongue out. Exhale through the nose. Inhale up. Slowly rock up. And we're going to get into, um, it's called celibate pose. So you want to sit on your knees. Okay. Sit on our knees. And we want to cross our hands. Let me just see if she's doing a, um, oh, now this one, she sits with her buttocks on the floor. So if you can go all the way to the floor, this is the true celibate pose, but my finger hurts my knees, so I'm going to sit on my heels right under my buttocks. Cross the arms over the chest and press them hard against the rib cage, okay? So give yourself a big hug. I love this part. Bend forward from the navel point and touch your forehead to the floor like you're bowing. Okay, we're going to do this for um, one minute, 30 bows, okay? So... We're gonna do it kind of fast, but don't bang your head on the ground. Just 
Squeeze those arms in the chest. Take an inhale up, exhale down. And the goal is to get 30 of these in a minute. Just chill for a second. We're going to put our legs straight out. Okay, we're going to get on our sit bones, our sitting bones, our sit bones, foot bones. Okay, and we're going to um, bang, beat all the parts of our bodies with open palms, and we're going to be moving fast. Okay, so keep it going. we will do, I oh know standing, but you can't see me, but we're basically hanging over, okay? So you're gonna um, keep the back parallel to the ground, let the arms and hands hang down, yep, and uh, loosely remain in this posture. We're gonna do just a minute, okay? I want us to do it for three minutes, and I'm going to do a little chant for you. Um, guru, Guru, Wahi, Guru, Guru, Ram, Das, Guru. Guru, Guru, Wahi, Guru, Guru, Ram, Das, Guru, 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 Wahi, Guru, 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 Ram, Das, Guru, 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 Wahi, Guru, Guru, Ram, Das, Guru. Let everything hang. It's still parallel. Oh, parallel. See, I dropped my parallel. Guru, Guru, Wahi, Guru, Guru, Ram, Das, Guru, Guru, Guru. Guru, Guru, Ram, Das, Guru, 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 Wahi, Guru, Guru, Ram, Das, Guru, 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 Wahi, Guru, Guru, Ram, Das, Guru. Inhale, up, and come back down. Okay, moving right along, we're going to Cobra Pose, and, um, in Cobra Pose, let's see, one minute, and then we're gonna be rolling our neck in circles while we're singing that. Okay, so Cobra Pose, let's get down on Cobra Pose. Okay, and then I'm gonna scoot back and hit my plant. All right, so you're, if you can, if your back allows, don't strain. You might have to just be on your forearms and that way your spine is elongated and you're looking forward don't look at the camera look forward chin down now if you can press up okay and you're holding that all right now we're going to be doing some tiny neck rolls okay 
and I'm gonna sing to you. Guru, Guru, Wahi, Guru, Guru, Ram, Das, Guru, 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 Wahi, Guru, Guru, Ram, Das, Guru, 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 Wahi, Guru, Guru, Ram, Das, Guru. No, you shouldn't be in pain or straining. Which might feel different. If you feel any pain, just go down to your forearms. I'm getting a little bit of back twinge, so I'm coming down. And then roll the other way if you'd like. Yep, other way, 30 seconds. Guru, Guru, Wahe, Guru, Guru, Ram, Das, Guru, 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 Wahe, Guru, Guru, Ram, Das, Guru. Guru, Guru, Wahe, Guru, Guru, Ram, Das, Guru. Guru, Guru, Wahe, Guru, Guru, Ram, Das, Guru. One more time. Guru, Guru, Wahe, Guru, Guru, Ram, Das, Guru. Inhale. And now you want to get to where your feet, <laughs> your feet, and um, you're going to bang your feet. Okay. So get to a place where you can bang your feet. We're going to have our own little anger release here. You're going to still be in cobra pose. So if it hurts to do your feet and your hands, remember, get down on your forearms. Okay. And, um, oh, let's see. Woo. <laughs> Maybe we should skip that one. Okay, but you're just going to bang your feet. Guru, Guru, Rahe, Guru, Guru, Ram, Das, Guru. All right, so I'm going to do it for you for 20 seconds. Ready? Kick your feet in Cobra Pose. Guru, Guru, Wahe, Guru, Guru, Ram, Das, Guru, 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 Wahe, Guru, Guru, Ram, Das, Guru. So just Guru, Guru, Wahe, Guru, Guru, Ram, Das, Guru, 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 Wahe, Guru, Guru, Ram, Das, Guru. Okay, you did it. Yay! Okay, come to seated pose. And we're going to do a Sat Kriya. Okay, I love this one, but we're going to just do it for one minute. And um, I think we've actually done this. I think we did it on day two. Hands above, pointed. Squeezing the ears, okay, so your hands are kind of basket pointed up, squeezing the ears, and then we go sut, and the sut, it's S-A-T, but it's pronounced sut, okay, or sot. I mean, you'll hear versions. Sut, your, that breath goes in and up. Nah. Sut, nah. Sut, nah. All right, and your goal is to not, not do this, but do that belly. Sut, nah. Sut, nah. Okay, now if you can't touch your ears, it's no big deal. Just do, you know, just do what is good for you. Close enough is fine. Let's do one minute. Here we go. Set, nom, 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 set, no, 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 Set, nom, set, nom, set, nom, set, nom, and in. Inhale, exhale. Okay, now as you lay in your corpse pose, remember deep relaxation at the end of all the hard work. So, I definitely feel happier. Do you? <laughs> okay, so we're going to lay back. And just let the body really settle into the ground. Just had a good little chiropractic, uh, natural chiropractic adjustment. 
And I'm going to read you this just for the last 20 seconds. And so you can relax and just take this in as some advice from the yoga book. When the inverted anger becomes part of the body, the simple effect is that you have absolutely no relationship with yourself. Inferiority complex or superiority complex are a cover-up of inner anger. Manipulation and lying are part of inner anger. Not being self-sustaining or having a foundation to work it out is an inner anger. Misbehavior, wrong calculation, self-destruction, destroying the business, destroying the relationship are all inner anger. <sighs> It is the area of the heart, it is the blood, it is the circulation, it is the diaphragm. It is the heart pumping. The whole life depends on it. So in the center of the heart is the furnace. Either it can cook for you or it can burn down your house and there's nothing in between. That is the tragedy of it. That is by Yogi B. So, Yogi Bhajan. So let's just soak that in. We want the fire of passion and love, not the destruction and relationship ruining. So let's rock back up to sitting and slowly come back to a seated position. We're going to sing our sunshine song and do a long sat short nam, which means true self, true identity. So we rid ourselves of all the anger and we can really focus on our true self instead of what our ego is mad at. May the long time sun shine upon you, all love surround you and the pure light within you guide your way on. So peace and harmony to all of Mother Earth, the trees, the sky, the birds, the bees, the insects, all the pollinators, all the mysterious insects we like or don't like. Really giving thanks to our grounding mother today to keep us centered and focused. Thank you for being with me today and for spreading your joy and light with others. Sat Bye. See you tomorrow.